would like chaos too, but yeah. that is that is chaos. That yeah. rematch is chaos. Yeah. That I, rematch is the the greatest head kick come from behind knockout ever. I don't see that rematch against being a chaos. guy who's arguably the greatest welterweight of all time next to George St. Pierre. I think I, I think for Leon Edwards to pull that off a second time is not good. Who fucking knows what happens, man? He won the first fight. That's all you need to know. He <sighs> won. He, he figured out a way to connect and he did it. Now that he knows he can do that, you don't think he's gonna be more confident? It's very interesting. Still gonna sell that wrestling shit. To protect, yeah, he does. But he also mounted him. He also took. Camaro he also down got dominated for yeah. three rounds. Yeah, he also yeah. head kicked him into another dimension. For sure, that's all real. That all happened. That's real. Yeah, and there's the no idea, luck in fighting. The idea that that can't happen again is crazy. It happened. It happened three weeks ago. I mean, it can fucking happen again. That that is so exciting to me. Would you bet on it? I wouldn't. You bet. Would bet on that happening? No, not a chance. No, I wouldn't bet on it and not happening either, though. It'll get a new head if I head was if, head. if I was objective if I was objective yeah. and yes. I wasn't a commentator you, yeah. and I didn't love both of those men yep. I do me too I would have to look at the careers I would have to look at the result of the last fight and I would have to make a reasonable assumption about how I think Usman could avoid that head kick and avoid strikes and I'd have to think long and hard about what kind of odds I'm getting because I'm probably getting bad odds I'm probably getting Usman as a favorite big coming favorite. into the revenge. big favorite maybe he's also won nine rounds out of, uh, out of the or well I'm sorry he's won. Basically, six rounds out of the eight rounds they yeah. fought, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, well, you have to look at the first fight in terms of like Leon really never wrestled at all. And I don't count the first fight. They're young. But you just did. Well, I'm just well, I'm too, if you're going for odds, yeah, and you're looking saying, at a mass of it. You can't really count that because Leon, they're both so new. Right. It was Usman's second fight ever. He was a straight wrestler. He's with Trevor Whitman now, right? Yeah, I would look at the the last fight, and I would yes. say Usman. You got to think he's favorite to be able to do that and avoid the head kick. He's but, a three to one favorite. Joe. But you also got to think that if Leon did land that head kick in the first fight, then he can do it again, and he can land a punch or an elbow or a knee. You never know. And yeah, also the sure. confidence that comes with knocking a man out and becoming the world champion and then rematching in Wembley Stadium when you're a fucking kid that, like he says, come from the trenches. I know. I, and I love Leon Edwards. And it's not, I'm half English, so the I root energy, for English fighters. The energy in that fucking arena is going to be insane. Insane. I would bet my house on Usman. Also, Usman is, is worried about that head kick, which might open him up for other things. You never know. So. You never You're know. You're dealing with different animals. Yeah, you are. You're dealing, You're dealing with, with different with the animals. Oh, head kick oh, oh, by oh. Whitaker. He just landed a head kick. Oh, shit. That was a good oh. head kick. Oh, right Land hand. in there. Oh, shit. Robert Whitaker. I always root for Robert Whitaker. So I love I've never his met style. him, but I, yeah, I love his style. I, he's a good dad. I think he has three daughters. I but, just root for him. As a fighter, like no one fights like him. It's very.